Hello and thank you for choosing Kinetic Hosting. In today's tutorial, I will be showing you how to install mods on your Terraria server. So without further ado, let's hop right into this, shall we? First things first, make sure you have Tmod Loader on your server on the Kinetic panel. You can head to the Change Software tool in the Games tool tab and type in Tmod Loader. And you can see right here that it's already selected, but if it's not, select it and then reinstall your server. All right, now that we are on the Tmod Loader client, click on Workshop, Manage Mods, and assuming you already have the mods that you want to play, you're good to go there. Click on the Open Mods folder. Two folders will open on your computer. One will just have the Enable the .json inside of it, and then the other one will have most likely the mods here. So what you're going to do now is head to the Kinetic panel and make sure your server's offline. Head to the file manager on the left hand side, head to this mods folder, and you'll see this enable.json here. Go ahead and just delete that, we don't need that. Then what you're going to do is have that one folder with the enable.json inside of it and drag and drop that into the mods folder. And you can see it's right here. Next thing you're going to want to do is get that other folder that have your mods inside of it. And I would like to know, make sure these are the same IDs as they would be on the Steam Workshop, so just compare the file name to the last extension of the Steam Workshop page. Then what you're going to do is open up one of the mods you want. You should see a few folders here. Most likely it is the recent one that you've opened. So for an example, mine would be 2023.11. Open that and you will see the mods name .tmod file here. Now that you're still in the mods folder on the Kinetic panel, drag and drop that tmod file of the mod that you want to play or mods and then drag and drop them in there. You will repeat this process for however many mods you have so you can get them on the server. All right, now that you have them in your mods folder, click the back arrow, go to the saves file and then delete the worlds folder. If you want to keep your world, I recommend creating a backup before doing so within the backup manager. And all you're gonna do is head to your console, click the start button in the top right of your screen and your server will start. Your server may take a little while to turn on depending on what you're loading here. So if you're loading a lot of mods, it may take a few minutes. But that is how you install mods on your Terraria server. If this video helped you out, make sure to smack that like button, subscribe for future tutorials. Thank you so much for choosing Canada Coasting, and we will see you around.